This is my little contribution to get the 2DS to work with the CirclePad Pro. As you can see, the CirclePad Pro has been modified. I took a rotary tool and flattened it out. It's not the prettiest thing in the world. On the back where the sensor or the IR blaster is, I cut the top off, took off the glass portion that protects it, which I will put back eventually. It's going to look a lot prettier than this when I'm done. Um, in the back, I just cut out a little notch for this sensor to kind of sit in, more or less. But the idea is to have it pointed up. And over here, let's take the 2DS, get it in. As you can see, it says connection failed. Let's fix that real quick. Oh wait, oh yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. gotta fix that. Um, options down, this is kind of difficult to do because I'm holding a camera up. Here we go, circle pad pro sensitivity. Oh, disabled, enable it. Okay, next. Oops, now I have to calibrate it down there. There we go. Boom. It works. Calibration complete. Oops, and I'm covering the camera screen. That's not good. Um, let's go back. Change the settings or change settings. Yes, save it. I good. Go back to the game screen. Now, as you can see, we have camera movement, and again, the IR blaster is pointing up at the IR sensor on the 2DS, right above the game card slot. So, it's working. Again, my other hand isn't free. Um, that's basically it. Thanks for watching. Oh! <laughs> How could I forget the best part? Look! It's gripping and not falling. What could it be? It is magnets. Magic magnets. Thank you.